here. This is a, a 1972 Pantera, referred to as a pre-L, uh, the Elmian luxury. Uh, it has the chrome bumperettes uh, before they went to the uh, impact bumpers. Uh, you can see this is just the shell, kind of trying to do a restoration on it. And uh, it's kind of a monocoque uh, frame or unibody. And uh, so you can see a slow project getting slower. What about the uh, power plant? Where is, do you have that? Uh, that actually is a 351 Cleveland, which I'm transporting it to someone that's going to put it on a dyno and break it in. And, uh, and those are the headers. Uh, these are ceramic coated and they're wrapped in uh, an asbestos wrap to keep it cool. Uh, so all this other stuff just is all random. stuff that's going, yeah, with me. Actually, in the box is a radiator. I'm taking to a guy to go through it. You got a nice... Well, tell us about this car a little bit. This is uh, actually a 65 MG. Uh, it was built in 65, but the title is 66. Because that's where they imported it. This is another project. This is my wife's project. Um, I love the wheels on these 60s. So, I like it because it's got... Oh, the those are center bumpers. caps, right? Yeah, these are the knockoffs. Uh, you have to get a hammer to yep, knock them off. A rubber hammer. Yep. And uh, so this body looks in really good shape. I see a little bit of yeah pulling out some uh, dents and working on a little bit of patchwork here. Yeah, I got to do the patchwork. This little rust, and uh, we haven't decided to either get a patch panel or just reskin the door. Uh, and I need a new valance, which uh, I got. We're gonna put in. I mean, it seems like this would be minimal patchwork here. It'd be pretty easy. It's yeah. not that bad. And uh, the guy that's going to do it, he's debating, you know. He says it might be easier just for him to just make a new skin. So what? Well, how do you have this in the air? This is on like an, a, a frame? Uh, well, right mount? now it's on a, a, a dolly. Uh, but underneath that, it's on a quick lift jack. And uh, the quick lift... If you go to the back, uh, I get a, high, um, a floor jack and I can lift it up and I can pull the legs out so the back end folds down so I can actually drive it up. What about the tires? Tires, uh, they're in a warehouse, but those are magnesium campagnolas. So you're going to use something different when, you're, when nope. you get it running, you're going to put them back on? Because I know those are fragile. Yep, and I'm going to use the same size tires. 